Either way. That's that's almost yeah. Um, so anyways, uh, SN2. Why is this an SN2 reaction? Oh, give me <laughs> give me some reasons as to why this already we know this is an SN2 reaction. Tell me, just tell me. Primary alkyl halide. And a strong nucleophile. And a strong nucleophile. Very good. Those are the best two answers. Okay. So primary alkyl halide. Strong nucleophile. Right. By strong nucleophile, we're talking about the OH minus anion, hydroxide anion. Right. So this is going to be straight up SN2. Definitely. Okay. So let's erase and then draw the mechanism. Can I erase that part? The interesting thing about this reaction is actually you're probably doing it in an um, organic solvent. So if you are, you can see this sodium bromide drop out of solution. Okay, so um, the hydroxide ion is the important part. The sodium ion is just the spectator, right? So uh, what's going to happen is, of course, nucleophilic attack, one step reaction. Remember, um, the SN2s are one step reaction. Okay? SN1s are two step reaction. And then you got to be pro. Um, so when we do that, I want to actually emphasize the SN2 nature of this by drawing, so we're going to say backside attack. So let's draw the actual nature of what's actually going on here. So if we want to think about it like that, right, it's actually coming from the opposite side. We get the Br minus as the leaving group. Good leaving group. It's another reason. That's the third reason. Br minus good leaving group. And of course, and A plus is going to want to associate with that because it's in an organic solvent. Um, so if it asked you what's your organic product, what type of reaction? SN2. Yep. Everybody cool with that? Everyone's favorite. Okay. Any questions? 